Hey guys, Craig here. Welcome back to more Paper Mario Sticker Star. In the previous episode, we went to Chain Chomp Rains. I think it's just called Chomp Rains. And in this episode, we're going to be coming into here. And you might be going, like, how on earth go get past any of this? Any of these obstacles? Well, you should bring um, an ice f um, base f um, thing sticker with you. A f just um, a what you um, a shaved ice hole too, strangely enough. So, it's just kind of funny just to see, like, a, basically an ice cream just, like, doing something for you. It's like, an ice... So that's it. If you ever want, if you ever see a volcano erupting, buy an ice cream and hold it up. And, you know, it'll save you. Also, there's the, um, secret door sticker. And this is one of my most memorable, like, levels for some reason, just because it starts off like this, and then whenever you move on, it just, it does go back to lava based, obviously, or else a lot of people will be disappointed. <laughs> this is a long, longer level, if I remember, about, if I remember, oh, <laughs> if I remember, I like what I said, if I remember, though, then if I, if I said, if I remember, oh. So first of all, you want to pick up this, um, scrap here, because you will need it later. Yeah, this is, this is like the difference, you can actually see the difference about, from, about doing a Let's Play blind and not doing a Let's Play blind. If you do it blind, I wouldn't have a clue what I'm doing here. And then over here, you can see there's another scrap, which is exactly the same, which means if we swap the two around, we might have different rewards, like we'll be able to get into the background of over here with this scrap here. <laughs> As you can see, because it's got a big hole in it, and the other one had a big boulder in front of it. <laughs> just must wonder what Bowser must have been like whenever he's doing this kind of stuff. <laughs> and, like, a wee bridge to get, a, well, not a wee bridge, a big bridge to get over. Ah, it's been so weird. Yesterday I was recording World 3 and now I'm almost moving on to World 6. Yeah, I've pre-recorded a lot today. I need to go, but I need to also revise for some stuff. Luckily, it's only like 2 o'clock. <laughs> and this, um, I think, will just allow us to, you know, get one item out of here. I'm not sure, though. Yeah. Actually, no, it allows us to get into the background of here. Let me see. Oh, come on. Oh. I was, I was thinking maybe I couldn't do anything apart from this. But this allows us, I think, to just skip that entire, um, you know, jumping section. Which I don't really like because I actually enjoy that jumping section. But if we just, like, make progress, I guess, through the entire level. Oh, this will be a very long episode, will it? So let's take on a few battles. Number one, as you may say, this doesn't work and my headphones just fell off my head and that's why I failed her. Okay, I've got like no, I've got like seven pages, but I'm only filling up the first page. Let's see. If I use a pie sticker, I'll do something. Yeah. We go crumpled him. And now, now we've got the upper hand here. Come on. Holy moly. Yeah, if crumpling also, if I haven't mentioned it yet, I know it's a bit late to mention it now, but crumpling does a lot lower whoever's crumpled's defense. Defense, even not defense. You can't say it either way, but defense is probably a better way to say it. Jeez, but wow. I love this level. I just. It might be because I'm a big fan of, you know, lava levels and all. And volcano up. Also, yeah. Do you see those axes, axes around here? You want, like, um. Um, get them hit by those, like, fireballs because if they're hiding something. Like, that one is hiding a mega flashy. Spin hammer, I think it's called. Like, so. 
let's say. Yeah, that should hit. Can we? There we go, that's definitely hit. So yeah, that holds nothing. They don't all hold something, but it's always a good idea how we look. Because as as you'll see, one of them does hold an amazing thing. Um amazing not really item or anything, but it's a nice it's somewhere you do want to um, visit before the end of the game and this is it. Number one to start off it's a wee clone it's a, it's a clone thing here. And if you jump in here you may, you might notice something. But first of all, Mario goes red and like starts folding and everything. And he goes underwater and everything. Till you start moving. But the real reason why we're down here is because it's the final Luigi location. Which means now we don't have you don't have to worry about looking for Luigi anymore, looking for those help toads anymore. And believe me, you don't have to look for the HP plus anymore because the last one is basically in pure sight. And actually we need to go down here anyway, because it's got a cracked boulder. So yeah, life is good. We're pretty much going to finish this level now. I don't think you have to like search for any more cracks now. I think I've shown off all of the locations. Also think I was... Well that's how we look first. I want to check but not get hit. There we go. Yeah. I'm pretty sure like all the cracks are now... F we've already like uncovered all of them, the holes. Yeah. So, with that, that means we can get back, that means we can do a jumping, for, like a jumping puzzle, like for one we skipped by doing that other thing. Oh, are you kidding me? I was, that was kind of unlucky, you have to admit. You have to admit that was a bit unlucky. So tell me, viewers, if you have any hobbies you're doing at the moment, I want to start golfing soon but you know I don't really have time to start golfing but I think that's like one of the things I'll do after I finish like high school I'll maybe do a bit of golfing every once in a while I'm gonna just cut maybe so yeah that's basically what I'm doing so what are you guys doing anything like tennis not even sport wise like anything ah for fuck I'll, I'm just gonna cut until I get to the end of this thing so see us once I get to the other side of the lava le le river. There we go, I mean, and that was an amazing way to do it because I got hit on by a, by a flaming rock, as you'll probably have saw. Okay, I'm not gonna try anything. I don't think there's anything really useful up there, and if there is, I'll probably put a wee, wee annotation on right now. Saying stupid, stupid, stupid creak. <laughs> and we can all hear. We can all hear the comet piece. And there it is right there. And luckily, with our scrap, our cracked boulder scrap, that means we can place it on here, crack it, and we've got a bridge to, to the comet piece. So that's good. So we can make it across how we got now. All is good. Well, not really, because we just destroyed the comp piece of trains. We can't make it to Bowser. Sad face. Or can we? Yes. <laughs> yes, we can. Oh, yeah, if we just like put this back now. The squashed comet piece, how is it still intact? I'm not sure. It's like this, and it's now working again. I want to check if there's anything up here first, though. Let's see, there's a crack here. I feel like there should be something here, since this is optional. Yeah, there is. So, what is it? It's gotta be a Mega Flash, something, I think. Yes. Have I got this one? I don't think I have, but it seems familiar. Eh, but with that, that means we have reached our goal. 
So yeah, let's just collect any coins. Oh, there we go. And with that, thank you guys all for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And hopefully see you guys all next time. Where we will be heading into the volcano for the rumble volcano. Into rumble volcano. So hopefully see you guys all then. Bye.